I am here with the producer of Caribbean Wives. Give her a round of applause. So tell us, you're making your mark in the reality show world. We know our first reality show was the real world, and we have a plethora of reality shows that came afterwards. So tell us what makes Caribbean Wives different. Well, Caribbean Wives is different because okay. they are different. They're from the Caribbean. We're in the United States where we are invisible community. So now it's time for us to step out. So yes. we're going to step out. Yes. And what we're going to be displaying and talking about is the women. There are different cultures. We have from Jamaica, Haiti, uh, Dominican Republic, Grenada, and where else? I think that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on, round of applause yeah. for the representation. Right. Uh, the food. Yes. Each talk about food. the cuisine. Yes. We're talk about the food. Yes. You'll get to see the women preparing the different food and the foods and the other uh, Caribbean wives are saying, oh, we didn't fix it like that. We fix it this way. <laughs> right. You know, so you'll see all of that. And most of the drama comes up about culture. Oh, okay. How they're different. It's the subculture, even though it's the Caribbean with one culture, but right. the subcultures are from the different Caribbean islands. Right, right. Right. So you have, is there, I mean, we all know that with reality shows come the cattiness, you have sensationalism. So how is that played out? Uh, it's played out differently, you know, if you know the Caribbean women, because they're all educated, they like to use the language, right, their right. vocabulary, and they argue about, you know, they use big words. Do they, but do they tap into their accent when they get upset? You know how we do. They, they do, and we have to <laughs> subtitle. Okay, okay. Yeah, definitely. Then you have, uh, you have Kendra who, and Terry Ann. Their accents is a bit heavier than okay, the others. So okay. you have to subtitle those ladies. Okay, so have you gone so far any okay. obstacles that you've gone through? Be because it's a Caribbean you know, show that you're trying to put out there in the market, I'm, I'm pretty sure you've gotten some sort of obstacles. What major one that you're trying to defeat at this time? Um, obstacle is trying to get to convince them that this is something that should be on national television. Yes. Uh, I, we've shopped it with different networks so far, but making the noise, we just came back from New York with the premiere, and we've made some noise and gotten the attention of BET, of VH1, and of some other networks. So we're in conversation. Okay, all right. All right, so really quick, we will be back with Miss Maxine and some of the remaining cast members. Okay, I understand that you have a clip of Caribbean Wives for us. You have a little teaser for us. Go ahead and introduce it. All right, here's a teaser of the ladies in their own domain. Did you or did you not inform this I guess she's upset that I'm late because it's probably like 3 o'clock or almost 3 o'clock that I'm getting there. I'm sorry, that's the time I got there. We're back to Thanks to Thanks TV with the gorgeous ladies from Caribbean Wise. Let's give them a round of applause. We have Miss Jen and Miss Carrie Ann. So tell us a little bit about yourself, Jen. Well, I am the newest member to Caribbean Wives of South Florida. Yes. And I am from Jamaica. Woo -woo. And I also represent Trinidad, my hubby. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> and I'm Terri Ann. I am from Jamaica. I was born in Jamaica. And I've been a wife for a long time now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give them a round of applause. So what is it like having cameras follow you around? Uh, it's, I mean, you know, it comes with the territory, you get so used to it after a while, and it's just, you know, it becomes part of what we do all the time and everything like that, so. So give us a little tea. Do they, do they basically run the cameras or give you like a little, a, a time frame where they test it out, view it, and then say, okay, let's go again, or you just jump right in? No, it's all raw, everything. They catch you, if you're messing up, you, they're up. getting everything. Oh, this wow. is, is live, everything is real, so what? Them getting everything. You mess up, you're gonna have to do it again next time, whenever we shoot again, and yeah. Wow. And no prep, none. Everything is just straight, just straight. And the accent is coming in now. <laughs> yeah, you know, I do represent all the time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so as far as the cattiness is concerned, I, I, yeah. I hate I hate to get go there, but yeah. we all know that unfortunately that's what sells in the real world, you know, realm. So how how are the relationships between you ladies? 
Um, we pretty much get along. Awesome. Um, there's a few of us that <laughs> need a little help <laughs> and could be jealous of the rest of us, but mm. that's okay, you know. Right. It comes right. with the territory. It's, it's drama, but good, clean drama. No hair pulling. Awesome. Awesome. Yes. So what makes you guys different from the other reality shows? I'll let Terry answer this one. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well... Um, I think we bring so much culture, thank you. I think we bring so much culture that a lot of America doesn't get to see because we come with what we are raised with naturally, our food, the way we talk, our accents, the way how we raise our children, right. the education, everything is, I think, so different from America in a lot of aspects. So I think this way, instead of being invisible, like how I, we're like not even seen in America, and then this way, you know, Maxine, she's like really driving and bringing us out there, letting us be seen because everyone knows someone from the Caribbean. Yes. And I mean, everyone can relate to everything we do. So, you know what I'm saying? This way, at least everybody can know. You might as well put us on the spot. You know Amen. Put us up there. Let everybody <laughs> see. Right, right. Okay, so as far as contacting you guys for any information or what is it that you want from the media? as far as publicity is concerned about Caribbean wives? Well, what we want is the exposure. Uh, you know you're getting the, the haters. Yes. But yes. They're, they're hating and they, don't, they haven't seen the, the premiere. Right. People who have seen the premiere have stayed behind and talked with us. Um, and we really listen to what the audience is saying. And I've also incorporated some of those changes that the, um, the audience suggested. Okay. Uh, so we're constantly evolving. So we are making some noise, and we want to make a lot of noise yes. in America. So, so how can so we? So they can hear. So how can we join in and make it a noise to get you guys on a network? On the song, su song, sang su sang. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. And what else? What we're other on, outlets? We're on Facebook. We're okay. the Caribbean Wives okay. on Facebook, so they can go and you know see the ladies, get the history. We try to post. I just posted up. Um, some pictures tonight. Okay. Um, of course, there's some drama going on between Terry Ann and another cast member. Okay, okay. And um, I posted pictures when they were close friends. Yes. So yeah. you know the drama goes on there. They're okay. no longer friends. Okay, okay. So, so there you have it. We yeah. have a snippet of the Caribbean Wives. Let's give them a round of applause. You guys show them love and support. We need to have, you know, we need, the, we need this buzz. Come on. It's a lot of Caribbean people all over the world. Show them some love and support, you guys. Give them another round of applause. <laughs>